Just like the world's athletes, Volocopter set its sights high when announcing its ambitious plans for the 2024 Summer Olympic Games in Paris. Over a year ago at the 2023 Paris Air Show, the German company said it aimed to fly its two-seat Evertol aircraft with passengers on board in the heart of the French capital during the Games. Despite its best efforts, that turned out not to be possible, mainly because it was just too much of a tall order to complete type certification with Europe's EASA Air Safety Agency in time. Nonetheless, in the last few days of the Games, Volocopter was able to show off its aircraft with a series of flights made first at the saint cyr le airfield in the southwestern suburbs of Paris, and then in the grounds of the Palace of Versailles, which was once home to France's royal families until the Revolution in 1789. Volocopter, along with other Evertol aircraft pioneers, are trying to instigate a revolution of their own in public transportation with air taxi services that could allow travellers to bypass road congestion. The electric aircraft would also reduce carbon emissions and are expected to be far quieter than today's helicopters. Quite apart from the complex process of completing EASA type certification, Volocopter and partners, including Airports Group Aeroport de Paris, have been working hard to finalize every detail of what it will take to operate these new aircraft in urban environments. During the Olympic Games in Paris, they had hoped to operate from a network of vertiports that would have included one next to the Austerlitz train station on the banks of the Seine River and also other sites at Charles de Gaulle and Le Bourget airports. Volocopter said it aims to return to Paris later this year to start the next phase of flight testing. The flights it made in August generated data the company said were needed for operational validation and were approved by French aviation officials under a special permit to fly. These flights were made with the 2X technology demonstrator aircraft it's been using for tests over the past six years or so. In Germany, Volocopter has now produced three prototypes of the production aircraft, which is called the Velocity. The aircraft have 18 sets of electric motors and rotors. Based on current battery technology, they will only be able to fly short routes of around 22 miles, initially carrying a pilot and one passenger, but later operating autonomously with no pilot on board. It isn't clear exactly when Volocopter will earn its type certificate, but the company is already making plans to conduct trial operations for emergency medical services with the German air ambulance operator ADAC Luftrettung. It is also working on plans for a larger four-passenger model called the Volo Region, which will have longer range, and a cargo transporter called the Volo Drone. AIN's Future Flight channel is monitoring developments in this exciting world of Evertol aircraft day in and day out. So if you want more news like this, please keep coming back to AINonline.com slash Future Flight. And thank you for watching.